Hello, 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 my replay people, especially. Let me flip this round. Let's get into some action here. Hey, boy, I'm going to do well to read what's going on down the bottom there, but it's all good. So welcome. Hello, NMMMO. Thank you for joining. So this is not going to be advice or a tip or a how-to. It's going to be a little bit of a kind of opening up an interesting question and a bit of discussion. But before we make that happen, um, we need a few more people on the line. Those of you who have been on my scopes before, you know the deal. I can't be sharing anything um, of significance unless we get a few more people on. So I'm feeling like, okay, it's a Friday feeling going on for some people. So I reckon, let's see if we can get six people on all right let's get six people online and then i want to bring up this discussion this subject about can we live happily ever after okay and it's a great topic so we've got zero people going on so by the way there's um wembley stadium in the background yeah you see a lot of wembley basically i live here this is my hometown and uh, you know i get to see this nice view of our national football stadium pretty much most days as i'm on my, on my way home um who wants to join in come on people get involved get involved eskimo annie how are you welcome to the scope please introduce yourself are you from antarctica So we've got some London buses in the background. Everybody loves the iconic London buses. Hey, Pennsylvania. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Thank you for joining. So we are in northwest London in a sunny town called Wembley, which some people may or may not have heard of. There it is. Wembley Park Station. Okay, here's oh Seb Reg. I saw Seb Reg. So by the way, um, we're going to talk about um, a, a particular theme. You saw the title of this. What are you doing there? You mean like I don't know. What does that mean? What do I do? What do I do for a living? Please, please just expand on that question. Sorry if it seemed really obvious. Neymar eighty two, obviously a football fan. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah, hit the hearts. It's all good. Hit those hearts. Marmalade Mumsy. Hello, Marmalade Mumsy. Yeah, Marmalade's big over here. Young Boy Sparks. Hello, 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 hello. I love the name. Vegan Vamp. Love it. Big up my vegan crew. I am awesome. I am fantastic, yeah. Um... I just spent, um, I had a two hour session with a client. Hello, my Russian friends. Um, I'm a creativity coach. I help people to love their life by reconnecting them with their creative passions. And oh my God, we just had some incredible. Anyway, I want to talk about a particular theme right now. Hello, Ant As Asia 090. I am going to talk about fairy tales. We all like fairy tales. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's all good. Oh, Marmalade Mumsy. That's so kaiju. Anyone like fairy tales? Hit the hearts if you like fairy tales, all right? And the stories are always interesting, especially when there's like a theme of love involved. And guess what happens at the end? Typically, something positive happens, all right? As in evil is overcome. Um, or the uh, princess finds her prince and all of that type of stuff. And then there's this wonderful little sentence right at the end. Do you guys remember this? Thank you. Happy ever after. Happily ever after. Now, do we really think about that? Let's think about that. Now, from a child's perspective, we would not question what happens once the princess finds her prince, would we? Hello, hello, hello. Sorry, you French people. I'm not even looking at the screen. I'm so sorry. Oi, V, oi, V. Evgen, yeah, Juicy, please join in. All right. Now, we don't think about that. We don't think about what happens. It's like saying that once you found 
um, your perfect um, ideal partner, then that's the end of the story because everything goes perfectly after that. But what do we know as adults? We know that that is not true. Wembley, yes, that's right, thank you. We know that is not true. So, by the way, so this is not advice, this is not a tip, this is not a how-to, this is just opening up a discussion. And it is really interesting from a child's perspective, but we do need to grow up a little bit, right? Oh, cool, you used to live here, nice, nice. We're going to need to grow up a little bit um, and think, well, hang on, when I do meet that ideal person, yeah, 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 I've been there many times, that this is the start when we meet that ideal person, this is the start. It's almost like when we start a new job, you know, you find this ideal job, oh, I've got the perfect job. That is a beginning. Marriage is a beginning. Giving birth to a child is a beginning. It's not a happy ever after, right? There's so much more to it. If you could really break down that happily ever after, it might be, there might be,